My name's Tony Hansen, and I'm an antler geek, and I'm also a gobbler geek. I just wanted to make this video to show you real quickly how to use our mobile publications. Um, background on this is antler geeks and gobbler geeks. They're digital media brands that are really focused 100% on do-it-yourself, reality-based hunting. We're not famous people. We don't go uh, with a bunch of guides and outfitters. We hunt pretty much like everybody else does. We hunt a lot of public land. We hunt uh, some pieces of private land, but they're usually pretty small, and they're almost always in heavily hunted areas, and they're almost always places that we just have permission of. We don't really own the land. Um, we do things just like everybody else does. But what this video is gonna focus on specifically are our mobile publications. So what the heck is a mobile publication? Well, it is essentially a digital magazine, for lack of a better word, but it's really not like any other magazine that you've ever seen. It's designed and distributed specifically on the iPad and the iPhone. So in a nutshell, what you're looking at is a free app. There's one for Antler Geeks, one for Gobbler Geeks. You can find it in the iTunes uh, newsstand. It's a newsstand app, so make sure you do that. You just go into iTunes and you search for Antler Geeks, or you search for Gobbler Geeks, and the app will show up. Install it just like any other app. It's totally 100% free. Inside of the app are all of the issues. Some of the issues are free. Half of what we produce each year will be free issues, uh, absolutely free. No, you don't need to subscribe, you don't need anything, you're gonna get those issues. Now that you've got the apps downloaded, how do you use these issues? Well, they're really pretty easy. We'll walk through it. The first thing you need to understand when you open the app, there's two areas you wanna pay attention to. The first is the store. That's where you're going to see what new issues are available that are paid if you're not a subscriber. Now, if you're a subscriber, the issues that you have already received and that you'll continue to receive will be in your library. If you go into the store and you buy an issue and download it, it's going to show up in the library. The free issues, they're going to show up in the library. And then once they're there, you simply have to download them, which means you do need to be attached uh, to Wi-Fi. Alright, so you've downloaded the app, which is free, and you've either subscribed or bought one of the paid issues or chosen to download one of the free issues. It's gonna be in your library. We just tap it to open. It's gonna open the issue, and now we're ready to get started viewing this. This is a very simple uh, swipe method, just like most uh, other publications that you might have seen on the iPad. It's not, uh, there's not a lot of those publications available on the iPhone, so iPhone users, if you don't have an iPad, this is gonna be somewhat new to you. Um, and it's important to note, the iPad version um, of each issue is quite a bit different than the iPhone version. And the reason being is, size of the screen. We have less real estate um, to use for our designs and we want to keep everything as readable as we possibly can for the smaller screen on the iPhone. But all of the content is exactly the same. Another note about your subscription. It is good on both iPad and iPhone. So if you have both devices, you subscribe once to Antler Geeks or Gobbler Geeks, your issues are available on both devices. Usually uh, there's going to be something interactive on most pages. The table of contents page, for example, is going to list out all of the columns and the features that are available in that issue. If you want to jump right to one of them, you just tap the image for that feature and it'll take you right there. To navigate within the issue, tap the screen once and the scrubber at the bottom will show up. And that will show you all of the pages and the features and content within the issue. You can move back and forth, choose any of them that you want, and it'll take you right there. Now because this is a truly mobile publication and designed specifically for uh, these devices, we're able to do a lot of things uh, inside them that you just can't do in a print uh, publication. For example, we're able to take a look at this decoy, a brand new uh, three-dimensional decoy, and actually scroll it and see how that thing looks as it rotates around. We have an arrow right below it that will show you how to get to the next page. The content moves up and down. We have a video. Everything that you could want to know about that decoy, um, we've included three-dimensional imaging, video, and text. It's that easy. If you have any issues, you can always get a hold of us on our Facebook pages or by emailing hello at boonermedia.com. 